Let's see if we can't do something about my boredom. Okay, time for some be old family therapy. Um, I don't know if these are Ramza's brothers. Uh, the guy standing on the bridge who's super pissed is Zalbag. Uh, he doesn't look as pissed now that he's kind of walking in place. He's uh, kind of an asshole, but not the biggest asshole. He's not like against you or evil. The other guy that looks like he's wearing a bathrobe is Dice Dark. I think that's how you pronounce his name. But he's like a super asshole. Uh, he's done a bunch of shit to perpetuate the war and manipulate people, including Ramza and Zalbag. Um, he's like the eldest of the Beowulf. He, uh, Zalbag has discovered, I'm actually gonna talk about the plot of this fucking game. Zalbag has discovered that Dice Darg is responsible for all of him, Ramza, Alma, and their, their dad, the elder Beowulf, Balbane's Beowulf, I think it was his name. Uh, Dice Darg poisoned him, basically, it was the reason he died. Uh... I don't know, he probably had some weird justified reason, but he's just an asshole. Uh, <laughs> in true, uh, in true be old family fashion, I like to think this is how all their get-togethers work. They're doing stuff in the middle of the room while Ramza stands in the corner and screams at himself. So they're like, oh, there's Ramza up to his usual antics. Uh, I like the straightforward nature of this fight, because, you, you know, you're in the castle, the be old, or whatever the name of the castle is. And it's just Dice Dog and a bunch of knights, and you go up against them. Uh, Zabag doesn't get much accomplished, but goddamn if he didn't go down fighting. Uh, they have, I think, cool sword skills as well. I like how all the B old family gets all these cool skills, and Ramza just gets guts. Coincidentally, his favorite television show as a child. But his brothers would never let him watch it. That's probably why they led to all this. Um. The reason I'm standing in the corner screaming at myself uh, is I this isn't the first time I tried this fight. I tried to do cool, fun stuff, but then Ramza got killed. He died. And I got upset, and so I was like, that's it. I'm just going to cheese the shit out of it. So that's what you get. Skip for experimenting. The Ramza that sticks out gets hammered down. I might bring Zalbag back to life. I do have math skill, because you can't... You don't go into Chapter 4 Final Fantasy Tactics Solo Ramza without math skill. It just ain't done. I'm sure there's some even more broken setup you could put where you wouldn't need math skill. But even Blade Grasp at this point doesn't like keep you alive 100% because the enemies have so many non-physical attacks. Like I think that's what I did the first time in this fight was Ramza had Blade Grasp and I just went in there and started you know cutting on the ribbons. And then uh, Dice Adar probably has Holy Sword or some stupid bullshit. <laughs> I say, yeah, I'm using all these broken tactics, but when the enemies do it, it you know. It's like discussing 
the 360 or the PS3 or I guess the the one, the X bone, the PS4. Whatever mine does is fucking awesome, but whatever stupid bullshit yours does is well, stupid bullshit. Uh, oh, I think I was checking my speed, because 30 is the max speed. Scream is a lot better than Yell. I guess that's true. I guess that Scream is like an upgraded Yell. Because in Yell, you're just like, oh! But when you scream, you're like, oh! That's my technical <laughs> demonstration. And you can holler, too. Or holla. Especially if you're going to holla back, girl. I love watching these fucking bumbling idiots stumble down the stairs after me. They're like a bunch of bobbies in an old black and white film reel. All hung on the side of one big car. And of course there's got to be a dog wearing a bobby hat too. And they're all brandishing their little black jacks or whatever those fucking things are called that they sock you with. Preferably in the gum. Man, what a boring fight. What a boring game. Why did I ever play this? This was a terrible idea. It's all fun and games at the start. I was like, look, it's Ramsa. He looks like a girl. And, oh, oh what are Delada and Algus going to get up to this time? They're like the odd couple. And Algus is like, Delada, you left the dishes in the sink. And Delada's like, oh, boy, I'm letting them soak. And then Algus is like, oh, no, my boss is coming over. Did you check the roast? He's like, oh, I checked it all right. I checked it all the way down me gob when I ate it. And he's like, oh, Delada. <laughs> This is a terrible sitcom. Do you even remember who Algus and Delida are? Ugh. Spoilers are both assholes, but for different reasons. In the War of the Lions PSP remake, you actually fight Demon Algus later on. He's still a punk bitch. And I think he literally cries for his mother when you kill him. Just to, you know, further cement the fact that he's a punk bitch. You can also get even more broken characters in that game because they put Balthier from Final Fantasy XII in it, and god damn it, he broke. Also, you could turn characters like in, well, I say I did it with Ramza the one time I played it, but anyone you can turn them into a Dark Knight, and god damn it, that shit broken. Ignore Heights. Oh, I love Ignore Heights. It's so boss. That would be like the probably well, yeah, it'd probably be the coolest part of being a dragoon. Because stabbing shit with spears wouldn't be as useful, I think, as being like, oh, I want to be up there. And you're like, they're like, but there are heights. And you're like, what? What is this? This is a strange word you're using. Is it French? And then you just jump the fuck up there. And they're like, he ignored the shit out of the heights. I think I was, oh, he's a loon knight. Ah. Uh, sorcerer job command. All magic rips apart. God damn. Is there ever been a more metal job command? Well, uh, yes there is, because apparently Zalbeck has Destroy Sword. It destroys parameters. <laughs> Holy shit, Ramza, your brothers are metal as fuck. God, no wonder you had to sit at the little kid's table at Thanksgiving. You had to sit over there with Alma. And she's like, don't worry, brother, I'll cast the Amberry on you. And he's like, thanks. You're going to house the spirit of the final boss. And she's like, what? <laughs> hey, pardon? Uh, let's talk more about the plot of the game because you care. Uh, Ramza and Alma are the youngest of the Beolves. There's the, the four Beolve children. I think it's Dysodark, Zalbag, Ramza, and Alma. And Ramza and Alma are the s children of Balbane's Beolve, but they had a different mother, which is something I guess Zalbag and Dysodark point out when they want to be assholes. They're like, hey, how's that uh, dead horror? It was your mom. Ramza's like, your mom's dead too? And they're like, oh. <laughs> we made ourselves sad. Rob's and Alma, coincidentally, are the ones that are not assholes. Well, like I said, Zalbag's not really an asshole. He's just, like, kind of doing his... Oh, here I bring Zalbag back to life so you can get the shit knot out of him again. Um, they, uh... I mean, Zalbag's just doing what he su thinks he's supposed to do. I mean, he's still a noble and a dick to the common folk and blah, 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 and, you know, honor and pride and all that shit. But at least he's not a manipulative son of a bitch like Dice of Dark. Dice of, is it Dice of Dark or Dice of Drag? The next time he does something, we'll see. Okay, here we go. Dice... Dice... D d I mean, what fucking language does that come from? Yeah, they're giving themselves little fucking arguments. 
ignoring Ramza. Ramza's like, well, I think, and they both look at him and go, shut up! <laughs> he even looks like a shit dick with his little goatee and his fucking flop troa Barton hairstyle. I love how he runs around in a bathrobe all the time. He reminds me of uh, Prince John from Robin Hood, but of course... Oh, what did you break? My judo outfit. That's the, the sword skill that uh, Lady Useless had in the last fight that breaks equipment. Uh, but anyway, yeah, he reminds me of uh, Prince John, the Lion Prince John from Robin Hood. Because this is the only version of Robin Hood. No, I was going to say it's the only version of Robin Hood I care about, but there's men in tights, which is fucking hilarious. He kind of reminds me of the... Prince John from that too, you know, think about it. Doesn't look anything like him. I mean, is Dyson Dog wearing any kind of armor, or is he just a guy in a robe? I mean, I know he's from the time period where people of his status would be wearing robes, but if you're gonna be fighting people, you know, put fucking, put something on. Put a coif? Is that a thing? I don't know why I'm, I just, I guess out of stubbornness, I'm screaming my speed up to maximum. Well, I mean, it does raise his attack and his magic power at the same time. So, I think I finally decided to do some shit now. Well, Zabak got up his sleeve. Use your destroy sword. Ugh. Don't just hit him. Don't just hit him. God damn it. You know an ability called destroy sword and you don't destroy swords? He'd be the ultimate at fighting the big sword that's stuck in Bowser's Keep in Mario RPG whose name I can't remember. Like, Exor or something like that. Look at that wave fist. Why do knights always know monk skills? Those are two conflicting ideologies. Alright, Ramza. Give him hell. Is he just gonna... No, I was gonna say he's just gonna walk down there and kill Dysodark, but the video's got time left, so... I guess he's gonna cast some shit. He's like, when this map skill hits at level 88, holy, you're going to see some serious shit. Yeah, bloody impurity and all that. Oh, I remember why the fight isn't over yet. Uh, something happens when you kill Dice of Dark. Spoilers. I won't spoil it for you, but it, it's going to happen in about 14 seconds. I don't know why it might. It matters. What do you think happens? What happens to every asshole you fight in the final chapters of this game when you kill them in their human form? Take a fucking wild guess. I don't know why I'm so mad at you, viewer. Zyback's like, yeah, I get his room. <laughs> and Ron's like, damn it! I like how that one knight's got his arms up and he's like, holy shit! He's like, we better be getting overtime for this shit. <laughs> and what Zodiac is that? Capricorn? Is that the goat? No, the goat's fucking... Yeah, because... Oh, and everyone disappears. And then he's just like... He's like, yeah, I killed Balbanes. Deal with it, nerd. Even a sword master can't fight poison. Tell that to Pai Mei. Oh, boy, boy, he died of poison. Bye, Zabag! I got he can just do that to Zalbag, but then to Ramza, he's like, Oh, I'll get you. Ramza's like, You're such a fucking creepy goat man. Adra Millet, Adra Milk, Adraville. I'm about to fuck his world up, I can tell you that right now. Oh, it's still that turn that Ramza killed him with. Do I just go down there and hit him in the mouth of the Excalibur? Because I hope I do. Oh, I didn't. I ruin everything. Well, oh, that didn't hit him for some reason. What the fuck? It's a fucking math skill, god damn. It's like go uh, No, that one doesn't hit him either. Motherfucker. Nope, he's impossible to math skill. He's immune to math. He's the he's the that guy from Santa Delivers Ultimate Nightmare. He's like, how do I reach these abominations? There we go. You'll notice it hits Ramza as well, and you might think that's a boner, but Ramza's holding the Excalibur, and so you can take a fucking shower in holy magic, and you won't feel a thing. Because, you know, it makes you absorb holy. I might want to point out its actual attributes. It also gives you auto haste, so it's broken as shit. I guess I decided to go down there, and his gob is going to get a right socking to it, I can tell you that much. 
Maybe not. Go down there and hit him with a sword! Stop with this stupid math bullshit! God damn, past me. I know you were tired of doing these fights, I remember, but Jesus Christ. Ugh. And he's dead. Wow, that was... That was a hell of a fight, yeah. <laughs> Rob's a must die of boredom. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, it's fucking beautiful. He just yells shit. I can't fucking believe it. I can see why I didn't advance to the text box immediately, because I was probably fucking dying.